What's up plant friends, Carlson Simon here. Welcome back to Plant Bang and thank you for taking the time today to be with me here today for another video. Of course, I'm wearing my mask today because I live with my grandparents and I wanna make sure I'm extra safe here in the house. It's a little loud outside and if you hear some music, there is like a congregation happening outside. It's like a church party. It's so loud, oh my gosh. Why didn't they invite me, rude. But anyways, today we are going to do an unboxing and before I get to that, if you ever wonder why my plants are so lush and healthy and happy and loving their life, it's because of my humidifier. I think the great plant rule is when you have a lot of indoor plants, you must have a humidifier. A lot of the plants that I have, they're all tropical and I live in San Francisco and the weather constantly changes. And at night during winter, it's really cold. And I wanna give these guys a nice environment to live in just like their homes in the tropics. If you live in like Florida, the Philippines, island life, you know, they're gonna love that weather. So we have to bring that weather into our homes so that they're comfortable. Now, if you're wondering what humidifier I use, the one that's always in my background, right now I'm currently using the Eleco Homes Ultrasonic Humidifier in the HTJ2119. Usually when it comes to humidity, especially if you're gonna set up your humidifier at home, plants like it between 50 to 70% humidity. And for this one, I usually have it at 70 and I turn it on at night before bedtime and I usually have it running until I get up and then I go to work and then I turn it off because during the day it does get a little hot. But for this one, it just runs all night. You don't need to refill and it and it literally fills up the entire room and all my plants love it. Before I didn't have a humidifier, some of my plants were not happy. They were like, what's wrong with you, Carlton? You need to give me humidity. So I went and purchased one on Amazon. Such a great investment. I highly recommend it. Plants love it and they are thriving. All my tropical plants are just loving life. And what's cool about this is it has tree, like tree, not tree. It has three levels of the mist and I usually have it on the medium level because my living room is so small and it usually fills up the room quite well and my windows are usually foggy when I wake up. But when it's really cold, I, tr I put it on the very highest level just so the mist circulates around the room. What's also great about this is that it has night mode where you can press the button and it turns off the numbers and it's very sleek, very clean. So chic, right? Now with any humidifier, I always recommend using room temperature water, filtered, always filtered. If you do not use filtered water, there's too much salt and, and chlorine in the water and it tends to crystallize in the humidifier and it's not pretty and it's just a bad cleanup and it damages the filter so with this i always use filtered water and i usually have it running for about eight to ten hours a day during night the night time when i go to bed and the plants love it and they enjoy life all right without further ado we are going to unbox my new humidifier my best friend Kay got me a humidifier for Christmas and I die. I'm so excited to open it. it. I've literally, it's been sitting in my room and I just wanted to like find a time to film a video and I wanted to share it with you guys. So here it is. It is, ta-da, the same brand. But, so <laughs> it's the Eleco Homes model SH8820 Cool and Warm Mist Ultrasonic Humidifier. Amazing. What's amazing about this one is that it's a top pour and you don't have to go through the struggle of taking out your humidifier, turning it upside down, get water everywhere and pour it from under. This one, you literally just put the water on top and I'm very excited. So I'm just going to read some of the description. It's 5.5 liter large capacity water tank, smart constant humidifier design, adjust humidity. What's really cool about this is it has the cool mist and the warm mist. I will probably not be using the warm mist because my plants, you, they love the cool mist. Um, you can use it, but it doesn't get too cold in my living room, so I'm gonna stick with the cool mist. Also, a great thing about humidifiers is it's a great substitute for heaters. 
indoor plants, they do not like heaters. It'll dry their leaves out, it'll hurt them and they won't be happy and the leaves will just, you know, they'll, they'll just dry and get crusty and they'll hate it. What's great about a humidifier is that it's a great substitute for the air in your home, not only to be clean but healthy for the people you live with, your animals, and also your plants. And it gives you that warmth without damaging your plants. So let's open up this baby. Thanks, best friend. Okay, so I'm gonna open it up. Here we go. Cute, it says hello. What's great about Leco Homes is that their products are so sleek, so clean. It fits with, you know, the, the decor of your home and it's not so bulky. You can just literally put it in the corner and it's hiding like mine. It's behind my plants and it doesn't get in the way. I like black because it's cleaner and it doesn't show any like dirt or whatnot. It's, it's also very chic. So we're going to take this. Comes with a manual. Here we go. Okay. So it comes with a manual. It tells you everything you need to know about the humidifier. I have to check if this has a filter, so we're gonna go through that later. But it comes with the remote, cute. And it comes with a battery, a little brush for cleaning. I don't really need my remote. I literally just go up to my humidifier and like press the buttons, dee dee dee. And it does everything. It also has, let's open this. a registration card so make sure you register your humidifier um and it says please register your warranty with now with a few clicks to keep yourself protected so you have to register it because it has a warranty and if anything you know happens to the product you um you just reach out to the company and they will help you with whatever you need it also comes with so these are like incense filters or like aromatherapy um, oils that you can put for your humidifier. Now, I do not put that in my humidifier because you don't want that for your plants. Big no-no, not good. You don't need these. Let us open this humidifier and see how beautiful she is. Okay. How's everyone's day, by the way? Are you guys okay? Having a good weekend? Happy Sunday? Living life? We're all breathing here, healthy, beautiful, love it. Okay, so just so you can see the face of the humidifier, you have your on and off button, your maximum minimum of mist that comes out, your timer, humidity level, um, on and off screen, so, so you can turn off the light and or turn it back on. Um, heating button, which I'll probably use during the winter once in a while, but I'll just, I prefer the cold mist. Um, child lock, if you have any children around, if you have the humidifier like on the floor or where they can reach it, you lock it up so they don't mess around with it or play with the buttons. And then sleep mode where you um, press it and then the screen goes off. So here you have the top where the mist comes out. Usually, okay. Ah, okay, so it's different. So this one, the top where the mist comes out on the other one, it actually comes off where you can clean the tube. But with this, it's actually connected and you have two. <laughs> you have two holes so you can direct the mist flow left and right. I usually have mine going right, going left, because I have plants everywhere and I want the mist to reach all of their corners. So really great function. And I'm guessing, so of course, so with this one, you turn upside down, you have to clean the pipe. This one, since it's a top pour, the mist just goes right through. Amazing. Okay, so top pour, meaning here is the bucket, and this is the water where the water goes into. How convenient is that, you guys? You game changer. Game changer. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Um, yeah, so you literally just put you don't even need to take this out. 
you take it out if you need to clean it. But other than that, where the water goes in or under, and you literally just put it in here, close it up, well, bam. Ah, okay. So, hmm. ah, okay. So, <laughs> this is where the mist goes through, upwards, through the little holes on top of the humidifier. With humidifiers, again, you want to use filtered water because you do not want the inside of the humidifier to crystallize with the salts and the chlorine and it really damages the filter. And I usually um, clean my filter once a week and clean out the water, replace it, and then give it a good wipe. Um, and like, I don't scrub it because I don't, also don't want to damage the plastic. But yeah, just clean it once a week. Um, just so you're, you know, you keep your humidifier always clean. And then of course with the bucket, it has a line for you inside where it will tell you the maximum level of water. Now with this size of a humidifier, you can literally fill up this bucket and you probably don't have to refill the water for like another two days, depending on how often you keep your humidifier on. I usually do it, just keep mine on at night. So the water, I probably don't need to refill for like another two days. But yeah, such a great gift. Thank you, best friend. And the fact that I have so many plants right now, I, I needed two humidifiers just because it's not reaching some of my other plants across the living room, across the way. Two is best, and it's, it's just a great investment. I 100% recommend it if you're an, an indoor plant owner, and if you have at least more than 10 plants, especially exotic plants like this baby or this baby, I 100% recommend you invest in a humidifier and you literally won't regret it. it. You'll have it in the long run and your plants will just be so happy and you'll be happy because it's such a great thing to have at home for health and wellness, clean environment, and a great substitution for heaters. So now I'm gonna take my filtered water. Ugh. So here it is, we're gonna fill it up. ASMR. Okay, so that was a lot of water and it filled it up halfway. So you can tell how big the bucket is and you can literally add more water. And you can hear the water going through the machine. Now, you put the lid on. And now, we plug it in. Look at that! A plug! Usually it beeps, and you'll know when it's on. Yeah! Turn on. Hello. There it is. It's working. So, <laughs> yay, it's working. Ha! Ah, it tells you the level of humidity. So right now it's at maximum, um, or the mist is at maximum, and you can change it to one, two, three. So humidity level, I like it at 70 because that's like the love level for my plants. So you can change it. So it starts at 30 and you just want to go up to 70. 70% humidity. Now if you unplug this, you have to reset your settings back again. The screen off, you basically tap that. Sleep. Clean. Beautiful. I like the top, how it's really, um, it's a big top. And you can put a plant on it so that if you have a plant that loves extra humidity, like for example, like this Florida ghost, you can put it here. You can like pivot and be like, hi, miss me. Do you, do you like that? Okay, great. Uh, also, with this humidifier, with any humidifier, do not place it anywhere near electronics, like TV, radio. 
when the mist goes on, let's say for six hours, it's gonna, you're gonna get some wet spots around, you know, where the plant is, the table. You're gonna wake up one day and the table is like wet from the mist. So you wanna make sure you don't keep it near electronics. It's gonna damage it. And then also, um, you know, one thing with um, humidifiers, it can cause molding. So just make sure you constantly check up on the surroundings of the humidifier and the plants and constantly just have a clean area and wipe it down and make sure um, the areas are clean. But hello, humidifier. Amazing, you guys. So that's it, that's that. This is my new favorite toy. Thank you, best friend, for this amazing gift. I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing video. Um, I hope it was informative. Um, I hope you guys invest in a humidifier. Believe me, your plants are going to love it. They're, you won't regret it. It's the way to go. Thank you guys for watching. Um, be sure to like and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. Bye!